Santa knows where to find all the best and hottest smartphones just in time to make this Christmas better and bigger than ever. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Ho, 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 ho. The murder trial for a Pike County man accused of murdering Letcher County resident 24-year-old Michael Hogg on New Year's Day 2014 finally got underway today. Jury selection began today in Letcher Circuit Court in the nearly four-year-old case against James Huffman IV, who along with another man, Patrick Smith, is accused of stabbing Hogg to death during a fight. The trial has been delayed numerous times, but more than 120 prospective jurors packed into the courtroom today for potential selection. Prior to selection, Special Letcher Circuit Judge Kent Hendrickson addressed several motions. Among those was a motion by the defense, arguing that a good cross-section of Letcher County residents had not been included in the jury pool. That motion was overruled. Hendrickson also warned the prosecution in the case not to delve deeply into the details of activities that occurred in a witness's vehicle the night Hogg was stabbed to death in downtown Whitesburg. Hendrickson also addressed media coverage in the case, which has become a major issue of contention by the defense, which has argued the coverage may have caused bias against the defendants in the case. Nearly all of the 32 jurors selected stated they had seen or read media reports about the case. Hendrickson said jurors' knowledge of the case through media reports or social media postings is relevant. All 32 of the selected jurors were set to be individually interviewed by the counsels on both sides before a trial jury of 12 individuals and two alternates would be selected. The trial of James Huffman IV is expected to last most of the week and could spill into next week. Reporting in Whitesburg, Chris Anderson, EKB News.